Hello. Hi. Today is Sunday, March 3rd, 2024. I'm Laura and Brenda, and we are here to talk about stitching, which we love very much. Yes. And it gets us through the hard times, which I'm sure it does for you guys too. Yes. Hard times, happy times, all the time. Yes. Stitching all the time. Yes. And we need to talk about that today. Mm -hmm. so, mm -hmm. It's a beautiful day out today. You might hear our chime, my chimes going here in the backyard because I've got the window open here. Yeah, so, it's like 56 degrees. It's supposed to be a high of 70. Ew. In Chicago. Yeah. On I mean, we're in t-shirts in yes. February, March. It's crazy. Mm -hmm. Crazy, crazy. Mm -hmm. so, okay. All what right. have you been stitching? You go first this time. Oh, I shall go first. Okay. Yes. Here's my March. Uh, when you see Brenda's, she has hers beautifully stickered up. I don't so much yet. But well, you always have it. Mm, yeah, you know. But yours is cute this time. All right. So, oh. show February. Oh, yeah. February. Okay. Yeah. Because we were mostly in February. But see, yeah. that's beautiful. Yeah. It needs more stickers. But anyway, nonetheless. Yes. Okay, what have I been working on? Yes. Well, let's see. The first thing I did when I, after our last floss tube was I adhered to some marching orders. Oh, good. Yes. So this is Martha Hard's H10 by Needlework Press, and it's a fabulously perfect marking sampler. Yes. And you you might remember that I had started it a long time ago, and now I finished it. Oh. Yes. So here she is. That's gorgeous. Isn't that sweet? Oh. It's on 40 count something with a red silk that I had in my stash, which I'll pull oh. out in a minute. But oh, I just love oh, her. Darling. Isn't she sweet? Yes. And a sweet little frame. Oh. Yeah. Yeah, I'll get Very her framed. Nice. Yes. Yeah, Very so nice. I used oh. a cranberry by Classic Color Works. It's a silk. That's gorgeous. Yes. That's very, very So pretty. it was very fun because mm -hmm. this had been languishing for quite some time. And uh, it was, you know, it's good to have a Brenda in your life. <laughs> Everyone <laughs> needs a Brenda. <laughs> so thank you for getting me going on that. So that is a finish. I did that. And then what else happened? Where is all my stuff? Huh. Hmm. Well, I'll just pull out what's in front of me, but I swear I had... Oh, here it is! <laughs> I knew I had another finish. Okay, so this is... Um, I think I showed it last time that it was partially done. Yes. yes. Okay, so this is Mary Edmondson 1812 by Pineberry Lane. I, I think I've said this a million times. I love Pineberry Lane samplers. I love everything that she does. Yes, I agree. Um, but her samplers are just spectacular. So I had started this a very, very long time ago, even before I think I kept records on what I was doing. And I started it on a 30 count, and I was using the call for DMC, which I um, put on drops before I started stitching her again. Oh, these are when we went to Phoenix yes. for our Yes, this was get a magical weekend mm -hmm. that we shall never forget. No. Um, we went to Phoenix for a little private retreat in 2022. Mm -hmm. Is that the yeah. right year? Yep. Okay. Yep. Mm -hmm. In February. Yeah. Okay, so uh, let me just say, I had started this on a 30. I don't, I don't know what I told you last time, but I'm pretty sure this is a 30 count that I worked it on. And I finished it beautiful and let so me tell pretty. you I know I had many quandaries about stitching on 30 32 with two strands with two strands right I had so much fun I can't even tell you I mean I was addicted to this and I think when I restarted it I had like up to about here so I did mm -hmm. all that stuff mm -hmm. I had so much fun I couldn't wait every day to get home and work on it Oh, that's a good feeling. It was. It was. Mm -hmm. It really was. Mm -hmm. So, oh, like um, in a little bit, I'll show you. I after I finished this on the thirty count, I was like thinking to myself, I know I got rid of a lot of thirty, twenty eight, thirty two when I started stitching on forty. Well, that was a mistake. Yes, it was. <laughs> <laughs> For you too, you think? Um, I didn't get rid of fabric. I got. Oh. I got rid of. Some fabric I knew I was never going to use. Okay. 30, 30. But I still kept all my lakeside 32, okay. Well, that was smart. Yes. That was smart. 
but I got, ri got rid of a lot of stuff and I still have a little bit, but then I was thinking to myself, I'm going to go back and look at some old stuff in my stash that I've kitted and I mm -hmm. found some stuff I'll show oh, it to good. you later that is on this 30 count and mm -hmm. I believe this is an R&R &R, yep. and I love it so much. I'm mm -hmm. going to have to hit up Ann and Pat and see what they have in, in this stuff. Mm -hmm. So that was so much fun and the colors on this, I just, I love them. Yeah, Pineberry Lane, her samplers are so dear and so mm -hmm. um, simple. Simple and perfect. Yes. 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 They're they're fabulous. Mm -hmm. Very prim. Mm hmm But they, yeah. I but they them. pack a punch. Yes, they do. Yeah. So that was a revelation. I had so much fun stitching Good. that. I Good. just can't even begin to tell you how much fun that was. Good. Okay, then... And I'm sure you have this, too. Yes. Okay, this came in the mail. Mm-hmm. The Country from... Sampler. Yes. It's Mary Napier Sampler 1832. It's part of a club, so it's exclusive to Country Sampler. It's mm -hmm. a beautiful sample. Oh, good. Brenda's got hers in the original condition. That's how it came. Yes. It's by the Wishing Thorn. Yes. And I love Burgett. Mm -hmm. um, she there has a beautiful sample. Go to the Wishing Thorn. Go to Pineberry Lane. Look at all their samples. Look at the sampler. It's just amazing. Now, see, I pronounce this Napier. Oh. And I'll tell you why. Because my aunt used to live in Benton Harbor, mm -hmm. Michigan. Mm -hmm. And the exit to get off to go to her home was Napier Avenue. Well, I bet that's a, a more sophisticated way of saying it. So Napier. I will try and do that. Napier. No promises. So you saw how the yes. threads came. Yes. And I put mine on a drop there. Mm -hmm. And I was like, I'm starting this. Good. Now, I have a consult already. Uh-oh. <laughs> I know a lot of people have already had this. Oh, really? Issue. Yes. Okay, so it's not really an issue, but it's a semi-issue. Yeah. A so lot of people have. It's I started it. It's on Weeks Coco 40 count. Mm -hmm. And I can stitch on it. You know, it's pretty dark. Mm -hmm. But I wasn't like, I'm not sure I want to keep going on this. I think I might want to change the linen. I'm just not sure yet. So I want to know what you think. A lot of people I have seen on um, Facebook stitching groups have yeah. gotten this. And mm -hmm. they do not like the dark linen. So they were looking to see what other people thought to mm. lighten it up. They wanted to know what this linen was to begin with. Mm -hmm. Some thought it was gray. Weeks Dye Works gray. It's not. No, it's it's, it's cocoa. cocoa. Yeah. Um, I like the dark. I do. But if you're not going to be excited I to, be to get home along, and, yes, then I would lighten it up. Maybe a needle and flax brea would mm. still give you the same tone mm -hmm. and it wouldn't it would be much lighter mm -hmm. um you might try that yes i'll have to do a floss mm -hmm. toss. or um right off the top of my head um dirt road <gasps> by fox and rabbit you love that mm -hmm. and that would um look good okay because i love this sample yes it is but a lot of people have been concerned about it being yeah. dark. And it, well, as you can see from the original, the mm -hmm. original w looks like it was on this, on a dark. But I don't think that's what Burgett called for. Um, yeah, she stitched it on Dirty Belfast. And oh. I don't think they make dirty linen anymore. Because that was used for something else. Um... The Winter Rose Manor by Brenda Gervais was originally done on Dirty. And um, that sounds so crude. Yeah. <laughs> so anyways, and that Dirty is this dark color. Oh, is it? So it's similar. Okay. Very. So I think okay. that's why they chose it. But yeah. you have to be happy with it. I and know. And I mean, I was fine. It's just like, but I wasn't able to whiz, but whiz around right. on this. If you're not excited to get home and stitch on it, then change it. Yeah. We'll and use happens. that linen for something else. Yeah, this would be great for like Halloween stitching yep. or something. Yeah. Yes. I mean, it's not like it would go to waste. No. So, no, no. No. Yeah. Okay. Then I was popping around for a couple of days and I don't know what I was doing, but whatever. 
So then yesterday came around and I was, I don't know what I was doing, but I was lamenting the fact that I had watched all the floss tubes that I wanted to watch and there was not one left to watch. And Mike was going to the grocery store and I was like, because then I can do whatever I want, you know, with the TV, which I can use, whatever. Okay, you know what we I'm all saying. get it. You know what I'm saying. So uh, then I sat down and I was gathering my stuff and figuring out, oh yeah, I had a big pile of stuff next to me. What am I going to stitch on? Because I was not going to be following any rules. I was like telling Audrey and Katie, I'm sorry, I'm out of our stitch logs. <laughs> I just can't keep up with the, the pace. It's only March, but whatever. So uh, then all the angels sang and there was a new video from Audrey. So I was like, yes. So I thought, I'm going to, I have this, the rose and the giant pear next to me by Hands Across the Sea, which I had not put on floss drops yet. So I was going to put them on floss drops. Got to calm down, I'm getting hyper. <laughs> and um, watch Audrey. Yes. So I did. Excellent. Yes. Excellent video. You all need to stop this <laughs> again and go over there and watch her. Right. And she is Stitch Stitch Bead yes. on Floss Tube and Instagram. So I was having a gay old time watching Audrey and putting, you know, DMC on floss drops. And uh, then she talked about our stitch along and I was like, oh boy. <laughs> so I decided that I was going to get that out and work on it yesterday. And I did because in a couple of weeks, I'm going to my dad's and I need to take some stitching and I could ostensibly get my February assignment and my March assignment done. Yes, and you will feel so good. Yes, I will. Mm -hmm. I mean, I have loved this yes. for years. Now, when did we get this? I don't know when we got it. I think, I don't know. Did I order it maybe from Access Commodities part? with the threads? I thought it came mm -hmm. with um, the sampler box that Kit and Stitcher did. No, okay. it did not. It, was, it predates that. By quite a bit. Okay. Well, good because I got all hyped up yesterday and ordered the chart. This? Yeah. Because I, I wasn't going to, I'm sure I have. Yeah. I, I ordered the chart and the thread from Who Been Frank? Ooh. 103s? Mm hmm. Okay. All right. Good. Well, that makes me happy. All right. So it's hashtag Marie Louise Pure Sal Audrey. Brenda and I will be doing it. Brenda can do it at her own pace. Okay, so um, I worked on it last night. And what I did last night was under that row there, I did this and that and some of this. Oh, very so good. I'm. this was February's assignment and this is March's. But, you know, I wanted to see what that other color looked like. Oh, it looks so good. Yeah. So my plan is to have February and March finished by the end of March. Good. Yeah. And I'm using um, Overa Swap. Oh, okay. Those are pretty. Yeah. And I put them in my new berry bag. Yes. So it's, you know, it's got an exciting new bag. Yes. We all need an exciting berry bag. And it came with this thing so I put everything in there all the silk and I will keep working on this throughout the next days good yeah good so that's good so that's what I've been stitching yes. Audrey got me hooked up about that Ooh, one good and um and I didn't look to see if I had it because I couldn't I don't know if it was a pdf also at the time it I think it, it was is a now. little gem okay and if it was a pdf I like the books better mm -hmm. than PDFs. Mm -hmm. Just me. So. Mm -hmm. Okay. Are you done? I am done. Okay. So here's my book of days. Here is February. Look how cute. And then March. Mm. Yesterday I was my mom's. Where is it? Yes. March 2nd was my mom. Would have been my mom's 84th birthday. So anyways. And it was funny because I was telling Laura, I moved some stuff around in my room and I'll explain later why. And one, something I had made for my mom long time ago that I framed myself and I used scotch, not scotch tape, masking tape on the back and blah, blah, blah. But she wrote in, in the 
fabric, uh, 3289, which is when I gave it to her. So it's a small little That's thing. Cool. It's nothing exciting other than it was from my mom. Yeah. So what have I been working on? Well, I ironed this morning. <clears throat> I know I hate ironing. Wow. Not because I, it's just because our iron situation is really do you need hard to, iron? no, it's just hard to get it all mm. out. We've, yeah, I won't even budget. So I iron. So oh, I'm going to show you again. You, you this. Oh, I love this. that. This is was an ex from the retreat last year at Hobby House. It'll probably come out late this year from Tanya. Scarlet House. Yes, that's Scarlet gorgeous. House. Oh, then I say. ironed this one. The work with care. This came from the uh, Words of Wisdom box by Hands Across the Sea. This will not be released. Love so, that work yeah. with care. Ooh, I, that. I just love them when they're ironed. They look so they look really good. Then I finished this one, which is Mary Gill from the Words of Wisdom box. Yep, mm -hmm. and that is right here. Oh, so gorgeous. let's put this behind here. Is that on Jody's linen? Yes, this is coffee stain. Mm -hmm. By Cedar River Linen. Yep. Yep, yep, yep. That's so... so um, tell us about your experience stitching these. I love these. Mm -hmm. I loved them. Now, so I finished that and ironed that. Mm -hmm. And then I worked on this one. This is, again, from the Words of Wisdom box. Ooh. This oh, one. one, Ellen, what, Whitlock? No, Windsor. Mm. Ellen Windsor. And I got, I didn't iron this one. Mm. So, okay, well, I mean, three out of four is pretty good. Yeah. I usually don't iron them when I'm working on them because I feel that the shred, the threads, um, something or other. It, it tightens up and I don't like that. So. There it is. Oh my goodness, you got pretty far, ma'am. So this is down at the bottom and across. Now this is going to be a little bit bigger than what I've had in mind I'm going to do with mm. them. But, is it on 40? It's on 40. This is on white clay. By oh, Fox I love white clay. Mm -hmm. And it's two different, obviously, just two col colors. Turquoise and plum. Gorgeous. Mm -hmm. So, mm -hmm. it's um, I I really like it. It's I'm still gonna do what I have planned for those other ones. The so, secret. The secret. Mm -hmm. Even I don't know. know. So Maybe. then, yes, you do. Okay, you just forgot. <laughs> you having a time? Um, I I have it in my head what it is. So maybe yes. I'm right. Yes. <laughs> well. So then. I want to do this one. These are the silks. This is available to everybody. This is Anne Rothmel. A lot of people have done this. And it's done on Muddy Duck, which is mm. what I'm going to do. And these are the colors. So this will be my next one. And this will be, let's see, 40 linen. It's going to be about 7 by 6. Is that so, like about the same size as those other ones? Yeah, kind of. And this will work with what I want to do. Okay. So, I just, I can, t all I'm going to tell you is it's not framing. Okay. I just don't have wall space currently. Yes. And I can't wait to get to this one. Um, so, anyways. And then I got all excited yesterday watching um, Audrey's video. And I will talk about what I pulled out after oh, good. watching that. Yeah, Audrey showed a lot of hats. Like, oh. Oh my God. Yes. Mm -hmm. So, anyhow. Okay. That's well, that. yesterday when I was stitching with the Overa Soie, mm -hmm. I had an old, I never have used beeswax or thread heaven or whatever magic this or that. But <laughs> when Brenda said she would had been using it for 103s, then one day I found a little, like this size, beeswax thing. And I thought, well, I'll just try it. Well, I was addicted. Oh, addicted, I tell you, um, especially with the silks. So then I had in my head, like, I want like a, you know, a big block of it or something, you know? And because um, I've, oh, every time I've gotten beeswax, I've 
given it away to my mom because she likes to use it too. And I've always gotten cute little things, you know, like Stacey Nash's daughter makes yes. you know, all those cute ones. Beautiful that you don't ones. even want to use. Right, I agree. You know? Anyway, so I, I asked Brenda if, where do you get a thing like this, a beeswax? She said, well, let me tell you. She had some. Look at this. I, you can get them from Amazon, these blocks. They come yeah. like 10 of them or something. It says beeswax on it, too. I'm so excited. Well, also, Brenda said that... You need to put it in a tin so it doesn't dry out, which mine, I had just sitting out, and it's not as effective. So Brenda said, bring a tin. So I did. I have this tin that we got in Paris a long time ago. la di da <laughs> And um, so she gave me two, which is excessive. I think maybe you should keep No, them. you have them both. Look at this. Yes. I cannot wait to go home and be beeswaxing. Yes. And then Brenda reminded me that we got these cool tins at Hobby House. They're smaller. Yes. We got to find those and see if uh, they'll they, fit in there. They will? Yeah. I mm -hmm. know they will because the one that I am using, well, it's down on the floor now. I'm not going to get it. But mm -hmm. it's one Laura gave me. It's Simplicity. Oh, yeah. And it's, it's a, the same size? Yes. Okay. Yes. So. All right. Oh, I know. And they fit, two of them fit in there perfectly. Oh. Yes. Here. Hold on. Okay. Yeah. Hold, please. Let me get down here. Fall off my yeah, chair. these simplicity things were used to be at Joann's. I don't know why they discontinued yes. them because they are so. So here's the one, the size. Yeah. Oh, you're right. That little and, it and fits then, in there. Then <gasps> look at you. Now, do you use the so other side to do the threads? I use. I just see this is the one I've been using, and I just shoot like it. that the back of it. It, it, doesn't it doesn't matter, matter. anything. Okay. Yeah, you can see where, can you see that? It's hard to see. You can see kind of down there. So is so. this real beeswax? Yeah, it's wow. real beeswax. And you can get it on Amazon. It's cheap. It was less than $10 for all these bars. And yeah, it's just great. You just slide it through once, like mm -hmm. I said. And then I run my... Um, fingers through it mm -hmm. two or three times because I don't want any globs. <laughs> you know what's cool about it though is it makes your silk thread just a little stiffer. Yes. And I love that. Yeah. And wow. with us here in this when our furnaces mm -hmm. are on and everything there's static electricity and right. you know your hands are dry and this just solves all that problem. Wow. So I can't believe I'm a beeswax person now. I told you last time. I know, and I was poo-pooing it, and then I found my little thing, and then I tried it, and I'm like, oh boy. Yeah. And now, boop. Okay. Well, good. So, yes. give Here. it a try. It's not going to, you know, if you use, I used Thread Heaven way back, a long time ago, when I was mm -hmm. working with um, some metallics, and... You know, this beeswax, it's, you're not going to clump it on. So it's not going to, it's a natural yeah, thing. And so is the silk. It's natural. It's mm -hmm. not going to hurt it. So. All natural. Yes. All natural. Okay. Well, that's exciting. Talk about beeswax. Yes. Okay. I want to show you this. Oh, boy. Look at that. It that's, takes the whole screen. Yes, it does. It's a mama project bag from Barry for our Charlotte Warrington stitch along. Oh, is that gorgeous? It is. And then she is did amazing. A little lost in there. Oh, that helps. But this is fabulous. really big. And yeah. that's the back. Mm. And it fits in here with your book. I think the deadline for ordering this is March 6th, which is Wednesday. So if you're interested, better get on it. Mm -hmm. Go to Facebook, join the Homespun Needlework group, and then you'll yes. get a link to order it. Oh, There's boy. The fabric, the thread, this cute little thing. Mm -hmm. And then the specially oh, made man. little box that you put together. So it all fits in here very lovely. Um, the stitch along started March 1st with Olive. And it's going to be a two-year stitch along. 
I don't do stitch alongs very well. Mm -hmm. I always say, oh yeah, I'll do them. I'll do that. And no, never do. Start so, alongs are yes. good. So anyways. That's so beautiful. That. That beautiful. Isn't that great? I bet you're Just thrilled with yes, that. Yes, I am very, very thrilled. So that's that. Oh. I then I got some good. other. Oh, I wanted to show this. These are new releases by Trelly, the Spanish stitcher. You can go to her Etsy shop. Oh, I love this first one. This one right here is the Milk um, Milk Factory Sampler. Here, I think this up. is an original design. Yeah, ours. that is door darling. Then these I love. love. I love when you do that. <laughs> she gives you, um, yeah. You know, this week has been really crappy at work, Ugh. and to try to get these to print on our color printer between tax returns was like, okay, I'll send three now. <laughs> little game I play. Mm. Anyways. Keep showing your toes. Yes. Those are beautiful. These are from So a this is sampler. the original. Yes. Okay. And she's, um, you can stitch my flower with flower thread oh, or fun. DMC. Mm -hmm. Aren't those beautiful? Mm -hmm. Just beautiful. Fabulous. Go to her. Here's all the deets. Let me get it for you right here. And I'll leave that up there for a minute so that you can See where to go. She has a YouTube channel. Um, she's just uh, uh, this. This will fit in with what I'm planning to do. And oh, say that's that's adorable. a reproduction, isn't that? And again, uh, flower thread or DMC, darling, just, just darling, beautiful, so fun. Trelly, the Spanish stitcher. And then there's this one. This is a reproduction, a Spanish sampler Ooh, reproduction. I love this. That's so beautiful. That's, That's so good. And I think this can be stitched with flower thread. Yeah. I love and that. then this one, Adriana sampler. And I am from the town of Adrian. Oh, that's right. In Michigan. Born and raised. That's gorgeous. Wow, really nice stuff. Aren't they beautiful? Yeah, well, good stuff. So, and I don't know where that board's from, but you could get a board from April Homespun, Homestead Needleworks. Um, Chantel may have a board, or um, Stitch Etc. may have a board. So many places you can choose from. These are all by the Spanish Stitcher Trelly. Great, great, great stuff. stuff. Yeah, great, great stuff. Very um, nice. Then I was watching traditional stitches mm, with a. That's a good floss tube to yes. watch people. Janice and Rose. Mm -hmm. They do one once a month. Yes. They go over their stitch alongs, and they were talking about market releases. And they, Janice, had talked to Patty Mason, and Patty had some, what she called, seconds of linen, and asked Janice if she wanted them. And Janice said, well, of course I do. So they showed them, and I quickly hopped over to the website and bought three pieces. Oh, that's exciting. So they're just, there's no names. They're probably mm -hmm. gone by now. I'm just gonna show them to you because they're really pretty. This one. What count? 40. They're okay. all 40. And it's all just limited edition. Mm -hmm. This is number three. Mm -hmm. This was number six. This has a little pinkish tone to it. Yes. And then this one is stunner. Yeah, that's nice. Beautiful. So I got those. Anyhow, that was fun. Yeah, it was fun. And and Janice and Rose uh, really do a nice floss too. They you do. should go check them out. It's once mm -hmm. a month. It's just mm -hmm. wonderful. Wonderful, wonderful. And 
Okay. okay. You go. All right. Let's I'm see hogging here. up this Oh, time. when last week when um, Nicola was doing her floss tube, she mentioned this little gem that had come out a long time ago and showed the chart for Cicely Margaret Ingram. Oh. So I went and pulled mine just because oh, that looks like a fun oh, stitch. Oh, that does. Yeah, so this is available as a PDF on the Hats website. Oh, I'm gonna have to check that out. Yeah, well, I'm sure you have this somewhere. I don't know. I need to organize better. Yeah. So it takes a lot of threads, but yeah. look how fun. Doesn't yes. that look fun? Yeah, it does. Okay, uh, I forgot to show this last time, but I think I forgot to show it. I think you did. Okay, thank you. Uh, I ordered this from the Scarlet Letter. It's Elizabeth Masters. Masters Masterton, a Scottish sampler. I had seen this on Rachel Needle and Flax, and I think Carol Saltbox. No? Mm -mm. Mm. She's doing that um, other one that I ordered. Mm -hmm. Okay. Well, anyway, I was like, I need this in my life stat just to have it because if the mood strikes for a big, huge sampler. Or maybe she got it. I don't know. Yeah, it doesn't matter. Mm -mm. I saw it a couple places and then I was finally like, And this yeah. is really charted um, Ooh, nicely. Nice, right? Mm -hmm. Some of her old charts are like, mm -mm. yeah. But this but. is a good new new charting. Yes. Okay. Then on Friday, I I think if you saw my Instagram, I was so crabby. This week at work has been heinous with a capital H. So it's very crabby at work. You would not have wanted to see me. And then all of a sudden I looked at my email and there was two releases by Jacob Modern Folk and Brary. Both of them are stellar. But I immediately got this one. Oh my heck, as they say in Utah, I love this. I you. Yeah, that's totally you. Mar Margie Klassen's Borama, which I grew up in South Holland, Illinois, which is it was like founded by Dutch people. So this is just all over. I'm all over it. I was going to go home and immediately start it, but then... I got jammed up by the fact that I couldn't find my, I thought I had some Roxy Floss Co. Um, blackboard, which is what Jacob recommends in here. I mean, really, you could use any black known to mankind and it would be fine, right? But I was also still so crabby from work, I did not have the wherewithal to figure out the, the fab, what linen and what thread, but I really wanna be stitching on this when I go to my dad's because I think he'll appreciate it. Jacob has some great history oh. and pictures and just all kinds of things. Like mm -hmm. here's like a windmill of that period. So I'm not sure what I'm going to do. I was looking through my stuff yesterday, consult, uh, <laughs> and found this black coffee by- uh, Oh, that would be pretty. Classic Color Works. But you certainly need more than one. Yes. Yes, and one great thing about Jacob, he tells you how many skeins oh. of something you need because based on the stitches. So I mm -hmm. need about four or five. But so the question is, do I try and call someplace and get them mailed to me immediately overnight FedEx? <laughs> That's not going to happen. I know. At market. I know. Do I use 310? No. Okay, there we go. That's why we have consults. No, because I think that it needs a variegation. I couldn't, okay. for me personally, there is no way I could stitch something with 310. 310. The whole way. No way. <sighs> I don't care if it's a skin cushion. I couldn't do it. I need, I would need some, yeah, some color play. I could do like red all the way. 347? Yeah. Mm -hmm. I could do that all the way, but not 310. Okay. Well, I just have to figure out a black that's that I'm going to be happy with. This one kind of looks black brown. Mm -hmm. I don't know. There's one blacksmith blue. Mm, that sounds interesting. Mm -hmm. I think we might have to go downstairs shopping a little bit today. <laughs> I'm going to uh, raid my. Yeah, I'm going to. I might like, have some of the uh, Roxy Co. Oh, that you're looking for. Because <laughs> if if you do um, blackboard. I don't know, any we'll Roxy see. Floss Co. Black would make me very happy, and then I could order some to replace yours. Okay. Well, don't worry about that. So, I'm so excited. Okay. <laughs> All right. 
You could even use that fabric that's sitting over there. I was just thinking that. We got our, um, oh gosh, I'm going to have a hern right now. Um, do you need me to run downstairs? <laughs> no, I can wait, I can wait. <laughs> okay, we got our February fabric of the month from Fox and Rabbit. This is full moon, and this is slaying me. Brenda, I mean, Brenda, <laughs> Karen and Bren, you better make this a, you yeah. know, a full timer. Yeah. It's beautiful. Okay, I gotta settle down. I'm getting so, I mean, these Dutch samplers get me hyped up. I mean, you put together modern folk embroidery and this linen and, okay, I'm yes. gonna settle down now. Yes. Wow. Okay. okay, you better go because. Okay, I'm gonna show you some, um, a little bit of stash that I got this week. Okay. First of all, I got the I love cushion. that. You know, I was looking on their website. I couldn't find it. Is it? On the website somewhere? Yeah, because um, that's how I got it. They don't automatically send it to you. You have to Hobby House Needleworks mm -hmm. and just yes. Google or search oh, for yeah. Mary Alcorn. Yeah. And so this is the third piece that you've got. This gotten. would be the third and final small. Okay. Yep. And then they'll release the, the, the sample. Wow. Yes. Now I know you can still get the other two, the drum and I'm not sure about the um, spool. The spool, because the spool, I don't know if they have any more. So right. I don't know if they're going to release this, if you can get the chart and then just make something else with it. I don't know. Okay. I don't know. So, this anyways. is gorgeous. And Thornfield and the threads mm. and all that stuff. Mm. So, then I got, I don't know if you were on, on Instagram and Lori Bilesma. Stitched this and mm -hmm. I went ape, as Laura would say. <laughs> I could not get over to that website fast enough. This, what is that? Oh, that's this gorgeous. Is from um, she is I Leo Nora Craft. Um, I don't know where she's from. She's not from the U.S. D E. I'm not sure. Germany. Could, yeah, that's it. Mm -hmm. Yes. There's the information. It's an Etsy PDF. Wow. And it is spectacular. <laughs> How did Lori find out about it? I don't know. I don't care. She <laughs> stitched it with DMC. Oh, yay. And it is beautiful. There's the antique. Oh, it's so beautiful. All the bird stitchers yes. should be going ape. Yes. Kim. Mm -hmm. Are you watching? <laughs> you need to get this. It is gorgeous. The chart is beyond. I'm taking a picture of it right now. Beautiful. Leo Norcraft. She's there's a lot of DMC. Woo! -hoo. Okay. Right. But um that's what Lori used. And her finish was amazing. This looks Just, like a fun stitch. Yeah. Oh, I love that. I, apparently, that. Lori hadn't been stitching for a while, oh. and this got her revved back oh, up. Oh, good. So, go check this out. I don't know if you can see that, but if you go, if you're on Instagram, go follow Lori Bilesma, and you can see this finish. It's just, so, that was, I got that, oh, Right after our last Did last you? tube, I okay. think. Um, mm -hmm. That was an immediate shoom. Yes, and I didn't have any problem with the printing at work. Because so. you were having a good week that week? Yeah. Sure. <laughs> then I got my, from Dying to Stitch, I got my little um, strawberry from oh, Erica Mine's Michaels. coming. I haven't yes. seen this one, so. Yes. That's sweet. Yeah. That's a and great And make club. sure to save this part of because it tells you what's on the thread card, what the colors are and everything. So then I've been on a um, website, cross stitch, stash unloading only, blah, blah, blah. Mm -hmm. I've gotten several things from there. Mm -hmm. One of which um, was this is a 2024 calendar by, I think this is Reflet de Soie. Oh, yeah. Ooh, say. So this, I'll just give you a little... Hint. Look at that. Oh. And each month, oh. there's a different sampler. They're just beautiful. Um, let me see one for... Oh. Let me see. 
There was one That's that really amazing. struck my fancy. So cute with the way they did the dates. Yeah. Hold on. We're holding. Get down It'll be worth the wait. This. I love that. Mm. Look at that. That's bad. All that. It looks like some Berlin wool work up there and just amazing. Anyways, so I got that. Well, that was from, exciting. Yeah. I think she had ordered. Um, yeah, it's Reflet de Soie. She had ordered two of them. And so she had this one for sale. And I never saw where I could even get it. I don't know where she got it. Anything. Cool. Then I also got on Stash Unloading because someone didn't want it. I got the full kit. This is from Silver Needle. This is Tanya's um, for that club. Someone was selling it. Wow. And it came with everything. It was just released. I just lucked into it. Whoa. So, because I'm not in the club. But you know, I love Tanya. Mm -hmm. So, well, that was, was exciting. That. Yeah. What does that it say? It comes on with it? everything um, flowers and friendships. You reap and you wait and you sow something. They blossom and they, they grow. grow. Oh, that's sweet. Till they blossom and they grow. And it comes with everything. It comes with some pins and the threads oh, and that's all that good stuff. So. That was exciting. Yes, that was quite, quite a thrill. You want me to keep going? This no, is, because okay. we got to even it out. Okay, good. <laughs> good, good, good. Okay, so um, I have three other bags here. Oh, Lord. <laughs> <laughs> this bag has my, when I went through and I was trying to find 30 count stuff. Yeah. Well, remember these? Yes. Blackbird thingamabobs? Mm -hmm. Here's something dumb I did. So I started getting the club, mm -hmm. and then like halfway through, I said, oh, I don't need any more because I have too much to stitch. What? An idiot. I think this is before Brenda, you know, was telling me things. So um, the ones that I do have, though, came like this with the 30 or the 32 or whatever count. Mm -hmm. So that was exciting. Mm -hmm. So I have a whole bag full of things. This one. Yeah, because these aren't these aren't out. I don't think she's reprinted the Abyssidarian. Yeah, hopefully she will. This one I started. Now see, it's on what we would call stiff. Mm -hmm. And I like it. So I have some more things that I can do that are big. Um so anyway, I've got a bag full of stuff. Well, that's good. I'm glad yeah. that you saved them. Yeah. And didn't purge. I know. I should have gotten them all. But whatever. Say la vie. I mean, I can find some. You could probably fabric. find them on the uh, oh, yes. eBay, but they mm -hmm. would probably be way too expensive. Yeah. Okay, thanks. All right, so... That's your lesson to not get rid of linen, you know. Mm -mm. I I will confess, on some of mine, I did have that linen, mm -hmm. and I knew I was never going to stitch on it because I don't care for that mm -hmm. stuff that can stand up by itself. So I um, pulled all the charts, pulled all the thread, and s saved the thread in that, and yeah. the fabric went. So. Wah, wah. Oh, well. You know, live and learn. Yes. Live and learn. Yes. And everybody has, it doesn't matter what you stitch on. Yeah. Well, you know. Okay, let's talk about these. Okay. Okay. Uh, Brenda placed an order with Tammy at Creative Country Girl. And this is the one I wanted. I love that little house. It's darling. Spring little house. And this is the back. It's beautiful. It's beautifully made. She puts her signature tag on it. It's got green gingham. Beautiful spring bag. And I ordered this. Yeah. And when it came, it was a big fat package and I thought, I didn't order but one bag. <laughs> so, I didn't know what was happening. Right. So then, there was this cool card in there, which I love this vintage. It's a vintage Hallmark note card that Tammy had written a note to Brenda and said that I had previously sent her some American Jane fabric um, to make into bags, and I wanted one for my mom and me and Brenda, and so she did that. 
and look at what came in the mail. Oh, isn't it beautiful? I love it. Oh, and I love the color, the coordinating fabric that she did with it. It's just, it's got a little thing on in the inside for your, you can put your floss tags or whatever. Yeah, I mean, seriously. So um, there's this one yes. and mom, there's this one. So I'll let you pick. I bet you'll pick this one because the girl's swinging and they're walk. I can just see her, but thank you, Laura. Look at the little kitties. Thank you, Tammy, too. Yes. Oh, my gosh. Oh, yes. kitties on yours. Oh, there's kitties on this one. Yeah. And this girl reading the book. Okay, well, that's okay. that. <laughs> so, thank you. Yes. Thank you. And um, that explains why it was such a thick yes. package. And I asked Brent if I could keep the note. Yes. I just, oh, I just love this. Of course. Uh, of so, course. thank you, Tammy, Creative Country Girl on yes. Etsy, right? Um... I think she has her own website. Oh, cool. I think. Oh, Maybe wait. What does is. this say here? Yeah. Yeah. Tam Tammy, um, Tammy dot com. Oh, good, good. Oh, you freak out, man. Yes. Yes. Okay. So that's everything there. Okay. Um, so then I just have two bags that we have to go through and say what's what, you know, beginning, okay. middle, end. Okay. Well, so. Yes. Well, first of all. Yes. If you watch Susan Stanley's latest video, which you should be, mm -hmm. she had some scissors made for her for first stitches, which was the quilt project that she did based on the fictional girl last year. And I ordered a pair of shears. And they are... Wow. First of all, came with this little... Oh, that's so sweet. And then they came in this beautiful, I think, I don't know if Susan, she must have made these. So let me open it for you. She did an opening on there. And yeah, she sh talked about them on her most recent floss too. Yes, okay. I um, put it back the way it was. She tied this with, um, hold, hold please. There we go. Oh, wow. Beautiful. And here they are. Mm. And they say first stitches on there. Whoops. Those are gorgeous. And they are weighted at the bottom. So when you cut fabric, I'm not going to cut you. <laughs> um, you can, she did a demonstration of how it feels. I can't wait to cut that muddy duck fabric mm. using these scissors. I'm so happy for Susan for this project. I don't, this is a seven inch size. Mm -hmm. They're seven and eight. eight. Yes. Can I touch them? Yes. Oh, these are gorgeous. They come beautifully, beautifully mm. um, wrapped and you know, her little card for stitches. Oh, I'm just so happy for her. Yes, that is wonderful for her. And these are just, they're made in Italy. Yes. And they're a work of art. Yeah, they're, I think they're made by the same company that made the forged scissors that Oh. Um, I got at the attic and that Katie sent yeah. me. Yeah, yes. From Hoop and Frame. Um, yeah, but I got access commodities. Yeah. So That's anyhow. so good. And this mm. is just, oh, yeah, I think I'm going to have to cave on that. Lovely. Lovely. Then I got my um, Floss Frenzy from Fat Quarter Shop. Fat Quarter Shop. This is such a great way to get a collection of threads. Comes every month. Um, they're one, it's great. It's absolutely great. Then yesterday, oh, here, three more things. Oh, yay. These are by Brenda Gervais with I Need On Thread. Oh, some of you have already finished them. Mm -hmm. No, love that. Did you get them from Farm Girl? Mm -hmm. Mm -hmm. So they, she had some kitted up ones. All kitted up. Oh, those up. colors are fab. That's why I got them. And mm -hmm. I love this one. Love that one. It's spring. A little waxers in there. Mm -hmm. And then Grandma's Candy Dish. Oh, this is just so... I mean... Yeah. 
Brenda could design some anything, and I'm buying it. Anything, and seriously, <laughs> there are very few designers. There's three that I do would do that for, and she's one of them. So, duly noted. Tanya. Well, there's four: Blackbird, Tanya, Hats, and Brenda yeah. Gervais. Yes. Anyhow, so speaking of hats, I after watching Audrey yesterday, I was all like. <laughs> Breathless. Yes. Kept up. Yes. So I went down to, we, this is the one that we got at, it's not out, won't be out till next year. We got it at Sampler Symposium. We got the chart and here's the beautiful colors. I love this, bit, yes. this sampler. It's so cute. It's, I mean, Audrey's going to be done with I it. I know. She's for crazy. It's gorgeous. Go watch your channel. Crazy I, in a good way. Yes. I love the frame on that. That's spectacular. Then I pulled out the other one, the one that we got at Sampler Symposium. This is Ann Morgan's. And I love this one. I don't know. This would be a little too big for what I want to do. But look at those colors. Jewel tones. Love those. Mm -hmm. I mean... Sorry I'm showing you these things, but when they do come out next year... Then you'll be ready. Yes, you need to get them. So that was all my... I have nothing more. Oh, the so table you, is cleared. I have one more thing, but it's oh. going to be the last okay. thing. You know how we love her last things. Well, this is for you. Oh. Okay. Oh. Okay. I have it covered up. Okay. All right, let's go through my bags so Brenda yes. can tell us, you know, what. I can what. tell her, but. <laughs> yeah, I know. <laughs> I like to see what you got in there. Yeah. So. Maybe by the year, what's 2020, 2032, we'll have gone through all my bags. 2032. <laughs> That's eight years. I won't be here. Oh. Oh, well, I whatever. Won't be living here. Okay, all right. Let's not talk about that now. I'm not in the mood. Um, I just found this in a bag. Here's a, a, a note I sent to a Linda Miller, and it came back. So, Linda Miller, please let me know if um, I can have your address, because I don't. And it was from a long time ago. And, oh, January 23. So, I need to send you this, Linda Miller. Okay. Here's something in a beautiful berry bag. Now this is naughty, naughty, because it was my 60th birthday sale. <laughs> well, I didn't finish mine either, so we're both naughty together. Oh, okay, all right, that's good. But you had, um, I know Ellen made me Ellen, the thing. Yeah. But I still need to finish this. And I'm stitching it with Roxy Flosco, and there's my blazing start. So I guess this goes in the start pile. Yeah. Okay. And here's the Roxy Flosco floss. Is there black there? Oh, yeah. What is it? Charcoal. Great, great colors. I love this floss. I yeah. love stitching yeah. with it. I love their linen. That's another good floss too, um, especially when Carrie and Caroline are together. They're hilarious, and so that's ever totes. Okay, got a lot of stuff in there. Okay. Oh, I need to brought too much stuff here. Let's see what's this. I like that. Bag. Oh, I've loved this a really long time. This is an amazing mm -hmm. sampler mm -hmm. by the Scarlet House. It's one of her first. Marion Farmer. Mm -hmm. I've got the NPIs that I put on floss drops, which some people don't like that, but. <laughs> <laughs> I'll confess. Yes. Okay. So, and we're stitching her on 40 count vintage pecan butter by Lakeside. So this is this is a travesty. Yes, it is. Oh, there's a needle in there. That's so unlike me. That's so pretty. Laura. Isn't it gorgeous? That's a medium. I don't even think it's a medium. I but... do because of the border. You got a okay. lot of the border done. 
and that border is um look at that flower in that basket yeah. oh killer yeah. all right so that one okay thanks sorry that's an amazing one is this by christy this bag i love it i think it is yes we're using Blackbird Designs fabric. Mm -hmm. Mm -hmm. Here, I'll show you guys. Mm -hmm. Oh, I was looking for this and I finally found it. Mary Hill, 1854. This, this was part of the um, Threads of History Club from. Um, yeah, Country are they Sandra. releasing this at market right now? Yes. Okay. I think they had already released it. Oh, okay. Yeah. Needlework press. Mm -hmm. Overdyed cottons. Oh, look, it's even complying with a floss strap. It's just all following all the rules except for getting stitched right away. Yeah, this is a definite just to start. Yeah, but that's oh, good. I think this is on needle and flax. Oh, is it? Let me check. Let me check. I don't know. This is a problem when you have too much stuff. Yeah, it doesn't say here. Don't tell Mike I ever said that. What? That I have too much stuff. Rick already knows. <laughs> well, Mike knows too. Okay, oh, here's another great floss tube to watch. Cardamom pins. Yes. Carmen. Mm -hmm. You want to see somebody who's enthusiastic about oh, stitching? It's she is, and she's fabulous, and I yes. love her. Yes. And she showed. Well, she talked about when we used to be when we did floss tubes in the other room, and this mm -hmm. sampler was behind us. This is Elizabeth Hunter by the Scarlet House, which is Brenda has the original that she bought from Tanya, mm -hmm. and so uh, Carmen was gonna. Oh my gosh, I thought I had more done than this. This is a crack. This is a start. The, yeah, yeah. I but that's so. on Lakeside. Mm hmm. Vintage Exemplar. Heavenly Days. I really thought I was farther. What a Yahoo. Okay, uh, so far I'm. Yeah, let's go. Let me back up here. Yeah. That's a start. This is the Marion Farmer. Okay. I don't know. Does it even matter anymore? No, it doesn't. Okay. It doesn't. <laughs> All right. Now we're just going to call this a what? whip parade. Yes. 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 That's where we're at. We aim high and then we come down to reality. This I love so much. This is by Whilst Iris Naps. She, uh, she has great samplers she does i mean that mary gibson yeah. from the exclusive last mm -hmm. year on the facebook group mm -hmm. that was i bet you the biggest hit that julie's had yeah. far none oh this one's i could yeah this one's oh this going is good yeah yeah look how i would put that towards that the is. top okay that is a that's beautiful Oof. you like it What am I using? Oh, oh, the over. She likes to use Christina likes to use um, weeks mm -hmm. a lot, so which this, is very good because it's it's readily available and yeah. um, if you don't want to use silk, it's less. It's, I and she love gives it. you DMC conversions yeah. as well if you know that's what you prefer. Yeah. Okay. Oh, say here's one you finished. Rosa Sugars. Yes. Eighteen eighty one. Oh, that's it. <laughs> Hands across the sea, doing it with DMC. I loved this one so much. She was four years old. Mm -hmm. Mm -hmm. That needs to be at the top floor. You, you could crank that out. Well, you know what you can do is out of all of these, you can pick one that I'll take with me to Washington with that would be the one I would choose. Well, just wait. Till I we're know. Done. I'm just telling you. <laughs> okay. Okay. All right. Then we have another. Oh, man, that's too confusing. I can't. I can't deal with that right now. Okay. 
What's in here? Oh, what's in here? Oh, yeah, this. this is by uh, Tabby Cat Linen, formerly mm -hmm. known as Mill on the Floss. Yes. Michelle. Yes. And Long you, white. <laughs> you can get a PDF or you can go to her website, mm -hmm. which is Tabby Cat Linen, and order the booklet. Mm -hmm. I need to get that. I don't have that. You need to go to her website because yeah. um, some of these are part of a book. Like there's three in one book. I don't oh. know if it's her or not. In fact, I just ordered um, from Michelle's website. It's coming in the mail. A red and blue French sampler. That's really cool. It's uh, all letters. It's a marking sampler. Oh, Okay, yeah. I'll have to check our website out. Yes, it's very fun. Hmm. Okay. All right. We'll just go through this last bag here, and then Brenda can tell me what I'm taking with me along with, with everything else that I'm taking because I have to do two ornaments, finish my assignment on <laughs> whatchamajig. Oh, it's never ending. Okay, here's one you finished also. Let's see, I started it before you, and you finished it before me. Oh, that's the one I did with flowers, right? Mm -hmm. This is Anna Morgan's mm -hmm. by I, Scattered Seed Sampler. I loved this one with the flower thread. Yeah. Mm -hmm. Loved it. Well, I started it's up it before. There. Way up there. You can't see it. Oh, bummer. But you did show it to us. Mm -hmm. Yeah. Okay, well, that's where I am. And... I, I bet everybody loves this look, especially Nancy Rose Bates. <laughs> Hi, Mom! <laughs> okay, so we got that one. Oh, this is the one I was looking for last time because Tara from Sully Stitches showed it and I couldn't find That's it. That's another oh, yes. floss tube that you must watch. Sully Stitches. Tara is so well-spoken has incredible needlework and so much of it. Stop this video <laughs> and go watch her. So her Brenda Gervais, Gervais parade <laughs> was and the Blackbird parade. <sighs> so good. Yeah. Okay. So here's I start on this one. I might watch rewatch to a I think you today. should. Michigan basketball's on this afternoon, but oh, they suck. They do. Ugh. So bad that you don't even... Are yes, you going to watch them? too painful. Oh, my goodness. It's too painful. Okay, so... I'm still a fan. Don't get all... I'm not a bandwagon fan, but... <laughs> not a fair weather fan. No. I okay. can... Just hard. This was in the Scattered Seeds Club last, last year. year. Mm -hmm. Forget Me Not Pin Keep. That's so pretty. I think I will take this with me because oh, yes, I could have knocked that it. out. Yes. Isn't that pretty? Mm -hmm. Mm -hmm. Yeah. Her new one that's coming out for this year is um, for the first one that's going to ship soon is lovely. So here, give me that. <laughs> okay, what's in here? don't know. Oh, it's a hat. Oh, it's two hats. Oh, yeah. Last sun, last floss tube or whatever, I said I was going to work on this, and then I didn't. I texted you about it. This is another little gem. Lily Thurza Edwards. Oh, yeah. That's a, so adorable. Yeah, a sweet little Christmas sampler. Mm-hmm. Oh, that would work for my Yes, it would. I'm just Sometimes I'm not sure about this linen color. Oh, that's the other extra piece of it. Where the heck? I don't know if I like it on this linen or not. The yellow's washing out. Yeah. Yeah, I would choose the darker. Darker? Darker or go a lot lighter. Okay. Uh, more like um, Thornfield lighter. Okay. Or that fox and rabbit over there. Mm -hmm gonna be good for everything. Mm -hmm. Also in here is another little gem. This is Harriet Gobi, 1849. Hmm. 
I love what this says. Be kindly affectionate mm -hmm. one to another with brotherly love. Mm -hmm. So what black am I using on this? Black licorice by somebody. Um, Gentle Art, thanks. Yep. That's a pretty linen. Is it? I don't know what it is mm -hmm. on the top of my head. But... Yeah, so I got all those in one bag. Good Lord. Here. Thank you. Oh, this too. <gasps> oh, this one. I don't have much done on this, so. I love this one. I, I think love that it. Justine finished this. Yeah. I'm pretty sure. This is one of the best samplers in the world. Mm -hmm. It's so cool. Tom's Foolery. That you should stitch it just because that reminds me of something you would say. <laughs> Quit your tomfoolery. Yes. I'm having some tomfoolery today. Oh, yeah. Instead of foffing about. Yes. So, this is a PDF on the Hands Across the Sea website. Freaking mm -hmm. great. Yes. Okay. There's my start. What happened? Something else. Nicola probably released something else, and I was all like, "Whoa!" Show the colors. Oh, sure. I didn't put all of them on thread drops yet. Oh, okay. But the one. I mean, have. look yeah. at this. The that the DMC. Is... Oh, and then there's yeah. more. Yeah. Showing the chart. Oops, sorry. If you if you get stitched from that, kudos to you. Oh, this is from our, this, I don't know what's in here, but this bag was from Summer School 2022. Barry made the bags and then Jean gifted one to everyone. Mm -hmm. Look at that. Fabulousness. So, what's in here? Oh, say. Margaret Beatty. Oh, I like that one. That's so Lots of you. people have finished this. Yes. Remember the sisters from Canada at uh, Hobby House? They had each finished it? Yes. Well, that's where I am. Oh, yes. And I'm using the 103s. <laughs> <laughs> but I could get this organized and use my beeswax. Mm -hmm. That should be one you take to your dad's. You think? Yeah. But I think because this bottom part is so intricate, that's going to be hard to do there because I don't have my usual setup. Excuses, excuses. <laughs> <laughs> well, I've got three picked out for okay. you. So. This is what I took with me to my dad's last year at one point. It's Mary Miller. Mary Miller by the Scarlet House. That would be a good one for you to take. I know, but I took it before, so I'm not taking it again. <laughs> There's rules. Anyway, the, I'm down to the fun stuff, too. Well, then you should take it. Well, I might, but we'll see. At least have it as an option. Because you could start that house and fill it in. Oh, that's a good idea. Yeah. Okay. And you don't have that much more to go. No. I sound like I'm chastising one of my kids. Really? Yes. <laughs> Do I have to hand this to you? Yes. Okay. All right. See, you can see that these are the ones that I've picked out. Okay. For I her see. To take. Oh, I like that one. Oh, that's a pretty one. <laughs> Here's Elizabeth Wood. Well, he's not one, huh? No, this one is... I am... Um, Elizabeth A. Wood will be always a good and obedient little girl. I mean, this everybody needs this sampler. Yeah. I mean, it's just amazing. Oh, and I put the things on a... Helm Scott? Uh, no, this the... one's from... Primitive Hair? Yeah. And I think I'm doing it in DMC 347, although I don't have any notation as such. All right, I think I got bogged down because I made a mistake and there's supposed to be three Bs or something instead of two, I don't know. I mean, I don't think that matters. Yeah. 
Oh, I can just keep going on that at some yeah. point. Yeah. That is a fabulous sampler. I know Audrey finished that one like years after I started it. <laughs> Okay, this is one of my favorite bags by Barry. Yeah. I love this fabric. It's pretty. Mm -hmm. It's from a true story about, I don't know when it was, but in Paris, this guy from Africa brought a giraffe to somebody in Paris, like a big wig. And it, anyway, well, look that's it up. Neat stuff. Yeah, if only I could tell it well. Okay. Penny would be able to probably yes, tell you. She, yes, I know she would. Yeah. This is Mademoiselle Viola Martini by GGR. Now, I've had this for 80 years, at least, with the Gentle Arts. And I know, the wadding up is terrible. Just terrible. That's pretty. Isn't it? Mm-hmm. So eventually, like this year, I plan to finish this. That could be one you take to your dad's. Yes, it could be all the red, easy red stitching. Mm -hmm. Mm -hmm. Okay. All right, you need to take all this stuff over here. Oh, you're gonna no, fold I'm that nicer. Fold this nicer for crying out for loud. For crying out loud. Okay, I got three more. Okay, here's one that our friend Kelly is going to slap me for. Mary Hart by GGR. Years ago, Kelly and I were going to have a stitch along on this. She's... Kelly's is probably framed and hanging on her wall. Mm hmm Yep. This could be another fun one. What the heck is the Look. What's in here? <laughs> Don't even tell me that's how far I got. I like that color. Yeah. Mm -hmm. What is it? Let's see if I said. You know what my new thing is? I write down the linen that I'm using right on the chart. I used to have this thing about not writing on charts, but now I need to do that. I don't know what it is. I think it's an XJU design. Oh, okay. Oh, yeah, it is. Here's the thing about it is reindeer. By XJU Designs. I like it. Yeah? Pretty. Mm -hmm. Okay, good. All right, so that's another one I have to work on. Okay, and to wrap up this little parade of shame, we have another berry bag. That's one of our first ones. Mm -hmm. I love that one. Mm -hmm. Oh, this one has two in it. Isn't I that did nice? this one. I know you did. This is Ellen Barber. Barber. Mm -hmm. Mm -hmm. And this is the one that says Home Sweet Home. Mm -hmm. Okay. Let's see if we can find the work. Oh, yeah. Oh, say! Oh. <laughs> what? The wadded <laughs> up? No, I'll tell you when we're done. <laughs> okay. <laughs> I want to work on this. Well, Look then you fun. should. Look how fun. Yeah, it was a lot of fun. Oh, it's so cute. I think I used DMC with mine. Good, because that's and what I'm I using. And I did um, a hem stitch finish on it. Ooh. And it was, the colors were just... Look at these mm -hmm. floss drops that I had made one time. Oh, are those cute? Oh, you had those made too? You've never had these? No. Are you kidding? No. Are you serious? I Are what? you serious? Yes. What? Was I insane for a period know. of time? All right, I'm going to get some reprinted. Those and that little girl, right? Yeah. Yeah. I don't, I don't understand that. No, I don't either. <laughs> I really don't. Get that all out of my house. <laughs> if, I, if I leave these, will we be good? Oh, <laughs> I can't believe I didn't give you these. That doesn't no. make any sense. Well, I'm telling you. All right. I'm going to go look at your floss drops before I leave, though. That will take you all day. I know. <laughs> okay, and lastly, if I can... Find the walk of mercy. I think this is one of those that, wait, 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 wait for it. Oh, here's, here I was looking for this one day. 
from Sherry Colorado Cross Stitcher, our Ose thing. It's all in with this. Here we go. Here we go. And finally, in the news, Marianne B. Horsborough by Hands Across the Sea. A little gem. I mean, if you want to talk about a little gem, this is a little gem. Gem. I love those colors. And there's the threads. Mm -hmm. I remember getting those um, from somebody. These I can't remember. floss drops were made by, in Michigan, uh, Sue. Not Sue didn't make them. Sue. And her buddy, Floss Toss. Oh, it's going to drive me nuts. She's real cool. She lives in Michigan. She has a shop now that has totally great stuff on it. Oh, I don't remember. Yeah. But I remember those floss drops. They were yeah. really cool. Okay. And. Oh, that's pretty. Oh, isn't I love that those nice? colors. Yeah. Ooh, say. Mm -hmm. No, I think you should take um, Lucy Barber there. Or is that Lucy? Ellen Barber. To your dad's. So you've got one, two, <laughs> three, four, five to take to your dad's for choices. Oh, choices. Excellent. Excellent. Okay, and then when I go home today, I'm going to neaten this all up. Okay. So that's my little whip parade. That's okay. about, I don't even know how much that is of my stash. <laughs> And then we had market. And when market started, we were like, we don't need anything. We can be cool. Let's be cool. And we were semi-cool, cooler than usual. Now, these are the okay, ones here, I think you here's should what, your dad. I don't know what's in each one. Mary but, Miller. By okay, Scarlet Mary Miller. Mm -hmm. This little one, the Viola Martini, so I can do more red, red alphabet. Okay, the Scattered Seed Sampler. Yes, the little yep. pin cushion. Uh -huh. And then Rosa, this one, Sugar. Rosa Sugars, for sure. Okay. And then I think this one. Okay. This one might be put over here. Okay. Take those. Take That'll these. keep it under control. Oh, and, and that one. Okay. Yes. Yes. And Off I go. These are the ones that save for another day. Okay. All right. Do you have anything else? Uh, no, I do not. Okay. It was so funny today when we, when Laura came in, I said, oh, good. I'm glad you have a lot of bags because I don't have that much to talk about. So we filled it in and it was all fun and good. <laughs> all fun and good. Okay. Yeah. Yes. So, and I'd love to see all these things because it gets me hepped up too. Mm -hmm. That tomfoolery is mm -hmm. like, oh, mm -hmm. gotta go down and find out. Mm -hmm. Anyhow. Couple, two or three months ago, I bought two lots of um, old magazines from the 20s and 30s. And I showed you last time what, it was in a nice little package. I didn't mm -hmm. take them all out and everything. Mm -hmm. Well, Julie, friend Julie, showed, sent me a picture of, she has three of them. And her husband nicely framed them. He cut mm -hmm. down frames that she had used for other things. And they're in her stitching room. And she has a lot more um, bigger room or whatever. She had a lot more space and they looked fantastic. And I said, oh, that's a great idea. So I ordered inexpensive frames from Amazon mm. yesterday. Mm -hmm. Mm -hmm. Just very, you know, just so I could get some of them up in my room. And I took down some stuff and hence rearranging <laughs> happened yesterday. Mm -hmm. But anyways, when I took these magazines out of the plastic that they were in, I found one that is perfect for you. Really? So, oh. my gift to you oh. is that. You can put that in your room. Oh my gosh. Oh my goodness. I love this. I know oh. you did. Yeah. It's from January 19th. Look at this. Oh my goodness. So, this was in a lot that you got? Mm-hmm. Oh. Mm -hmm. And you framed it already? Mm-hmm. Oh. Mm -hmm. I just got these inexpensive frames yeah, from Amazon. Yeah, perfect. And perfect. I kept them. The magazine is all intact. Yeah, it's good idea. I just I loved the artwork on it, and I yeah. this is you, oh totally my gosh. you. Thank you. You're welcome. Oh, that was so welcome. nice of you. I love this. I know you do. I knew you would. Oh my gosh, that is so fabulous. So 
in every single way just fabulous. and if mike won't let you hammer that wall i will be over there to hammer it <laughs> got it <laughs> i might just go upstairs and hammer it in myself yes yes i go buy nails and <clears throat> oh i love this thank you so you're much welcome. you're welcome that is perfection just perfection Anyhow, it's good to have friends that know what you like <laughs> and I thought January 2029 was I know. great since you were born in, not January 2029, but yeah. close, but not exactly. <laughs> that is fabulous. Isn't that cool? Yes, I love yes. it. Yes. Thank you so much. You're this welcome. is, oh. it's so fun. I didn't look through them. I was just more the artwork on mm -hmm. the front. Mm -hmm. um, I framed, we framed four of them. I have three downstairs and then this mm. one. So, and I have some others, but the f covers aren't as my style. Right. Um, but maybe Laura said, look and see if they have advertisements for like for queen hoops or something. Wouldn't that be cool? That would be so cool. So maybe cool. I would. Yeah, look through look those. And see. Yeah. And see. Yeah. Yeah. So, that's fabulous. Anyways. Thank you so much. You're welcome. You're welcome. So, anyhow. Okay. So our plans are to go downstairs, look for the black thread, and then I will. Uh, take my stuff and organize it nicely that I'm bringing with. Okay. Oh, that reminds me. So yes. I'm leaving on the 13th. That means our schedule is all kaput. It, yeah. The next one would you know? be the, um, you're coming back when? I'm coming back Saturday, but I don't think I'll be in any shape no. to do and one And then the, the following day. week is Easter. So hey. that may be in or out. So it might be a month before we're back. Sorry. Sorry. It is what it is. Mm -hmm. Life happens and mm -hmm. all that stuff. So mm -hmm. we'll see. We'll see what happens on Easter. And yeah. we'll go from there. Yeah. So anyways, happy stitching. And I hope that Laura inspired you. <laughs> and Brenda. Well, I love looking at all these old things. I know. And seeing what's what and, you know. And what shape it's in or yeah. how far it is. Or yeah. And it, it inspires me that tomfoolery. Mm. Yeah. Okay. okay. Well, if you start tomfoolery, I better get my butt in gear. Because <laughs> if I see it done on this side of the table, and on mine isn't, I will freak out. <laughs> we don't want that. No, we can't have that. No. No. Okay. We'll talk to you soon. Happy Bye. stitching. Bye.